I want to share with you um, an author and illustrator, Chris Rochka, and a series of books that he has completed that is great for young children, um, the preschool to first grade age. Um, these are his books. They are called, the series is called his Thingy Thing books. And you will see um, there are about six or se six to eight books in the series. Um, each book is similar. Um, the print, the title at the top, it always is whatever the animal, crabby, crab, moosey, moose, clammy, clam. Um, the font is in black with, it almost looks like it's been scratched off. The characters are always outlined in black. And then they have a splash of watercolor with some um, dots of watercolor inside. All of the thingy thing books have this color block pattern along the side of the books. And you will see all of the pictures on the front have that black outline with the watercolor splash and the watercolor blocks or dots on the outside. Just to show you a little bit on the inside of the book, all of his books in the Thingy Thing series, also the front, inside the front cover, have this watercolor dot block splash pattern. These books are great for young children because they have simple words that are repetitive. Krabby Crab has two powerful claws. He wants fingers instead. It's kind of very simple. Simple reading. Not going to read the entire book. But just to show you the pictures, they're similar, but they also are expressive. And definitely his artistry is unique in that it's kind of a darker um, children's picture. But it has that splash of watercolor with the blocks as well. Just going to show you a couple more. This is Doggy Dog. My daughter really enjoyed looking through these books. She can't read yet, but she made up her own stories based on how the character looks and the expressions that the character makes. And notice in this one, the cat actually has a white outline, but the black in the middle. So it's opposite. There are other pictures as well. So it's just nice to see it that all of his illustrations are the same and you can find the same throughout. And you could definitely say, okay, even if you couldn't see that the illustration was Chris Roshka, when you open the book, you see the thing, you could definitely define that that is one of his pieces of work. Okay, thank you. Bye.